Police believe concrete chunk that killed Tennessee driver was thrown from bridge. Police in Tennessee believe a large chunk of concrete that crashed through a driver's windshield and killed him Tuesday was thrown off a bridge, and they're trying to find out who is responsible. Josie Shelton Jr., 54, was driving to work on I-24 near downtown Nashville Tuesday morning when the concrete blew through his windshield, hit him in the face and killed him, according to the Metro Nashville Police Department. The Nissan GTR sports car Shelton had been driving then sideswiped a Toyota pickup truck and hit a guardrail before coming to a stop. No one else was injured. At this point in the investigation, it appears likely that the chunk of concrete was thrown from the Shelby Avenue bridge, police said in a statement. The concrete doesn't appear to have been a part of the bridge that could have randomly fallen, but rather a piece of the roadway curb, according to Tennessee Department of Transportation investigators. Police have reviewed surveillance video of the bridge, but have not identified a suspect. In a tweet, they asked for information from anyone who may have witnessed anything suspicious on the bridge Tuesday morning. Shelton was driving to his job at the Nissan plant in Smyrna when he was killed, according to NBC affiliate. Nissan released a statement that said, We are saddened to learn of Joe's passing. Our deepest sympathies are with his family members, friends and colleagues at this difficult time. In 2017, Five boys were after a man was killed in Michigan when a rock one of them allegedly threw off a bridge crashed through his windshield. Four of the boys have agreed to accept A. The teen who was accused of throwing the rock that led to the driver's death pleaded guilty to second-degree murder in October. Elisha Fieldstadt is a breaking news reporter for NBC News.